Hey guys, welcome back to Helly Handmade. So today I'm going to show you how I prepare my conkers um, ready for making with my craft. So um, like how I did with the wreath you've just recently seen. Um, so I'm going to show you how I prepare them. And I've already said that. We're doing well. We're doing well. I don't know where that high pitch has come from, but... So yes! please make sure you are subscribed click that bell if you want to hear uh, when my next lot of videos are and make sure you like and leave me a comment thank you let's get on into the video so these have been cleaned and baked so they're hardened ready to start crafts my lovely tesco wipes which are used to uh, clean the conkers and then I have these conkers left. Beautiful shine on them. But they, the shine, hold on. The shine on these ones will come back because once I'm finished with them, with whatever project I'm doing, you'll probably know by now, I don't know which project I'm doing first. So whatever video that this is in, just for that project and whatever else. But yes, so these will come back and shine once I've put lacquer around it and yeah, it's all looking nice again. And then yes, so it's these conkers that have still got their beautiful shine on them. They still need to be cleaned um, and then baked so they can be hardened. Right, so these have finally all been cleaned. So now they just need to be baked. So I will show you how I do that. So we turn the oven on to um, a fairly low setting um, and then make sure that our baking tray has either got baking paper on or um, tin foil and obviously put your conkers on. From there, um, once it's heated up, we then put it in the oven for about two hours. Apologies, my oven doesn't need cleaning. Um, <laughs> and then we'll leave them to bake for that time. Two hours later. So now that they're done, uh, we can, well I've turned the oven off already, but now we can take them out um, and just let them cool down. And once they've cooled down, then they're ready for us to do whatever crafts we feel like. Yay! Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this little, short little video of how I preserve conkers ready for crafts um, and I've hoped it's helped you in any sort of way. Please remember to subscribe, leave me a like and a comment and I will see you in the next video. Bye!